All right, so we're going to get this role, this show role. This is FLV, your hip hop uncle bringing you more and more stuff. So we're on the depth of Slim Shady ride. I'm going to keep on riding until the tracks <clears throat> in order as I was told to. But anyway, it's his fault. He released the songs first. <laughs> anyway, here we go. Uh, Skit all you got, so I'm gonna do all you got and Lucifer together. So here we go, 24 seconds, and then we're gonna stop, pause, breathe, and go to the next song, okay? Let's go. Man, why you doing this? Cause you owe me. How? Cause I gave you everything. What? And what did you do? You walked away from me. Yeah, but you're too fucking blind to see I was good for you. I made you. You were nothing till you found me. How many times you try to kill me? I always come back. You cannot grow me, you cannot think me. I'm all you got. I like this. Figuratively and listen in order and listen to everything, right? Because um how many times have we heard Marshall or Eminem or Slim, whatever you want to call him, try to mature and change the subject and you know do different things and grow out of it and it always comes back, right? You know. An artist is allowed to mature, but sometimes when you mature, you grew out of the thing that made you who people loved you for, right? So this is kind of cool because I think he's realizing that, you know, even though on the mur music to be murdered by, he bodied that and, you know, that was strictly different than the Slim Shady stuff as for the stuff that he did with the Marshall LPs and stuff like that and Slim Shady stuff. <clears throat> he's realizing that, hey, in the skit, but again, Slim, in the beginning, that's who he was when he came out, right? So I get it. So anyway, let's pause, break, chill out for a minute. We'll get you a drink. And I'm getting back to Lucifer in a second. Don't go nowhere. All right, yeah, we're back. Let's get it. Lucifer. The coup de grace is the final shot right between the eyes. Also known <laughs> as the people, kill shot. People, yeah. It feels so it feels good, 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 good to be Alright, here we go. Bad. Alright, let's start. Yes. I got it. Before I get banned, kicked off Twitter and TikTok, cause they so damn ticked off bitter. They want me to bounce like, what? like a fabric soft finner. We just got rid of Diego kick rocks with her. I but Dre on beats with the white face. Blondie on the mic is like what? having steady B and cool C in the ride. Like we rap and did a little bank robbery on the side. So they want beef, we can make like Bonnie and Collide. Haters can meet the same exact fate as my dad. Wait, at least he didn't miss me graduate. Yeah, great. But mom, do I still act eight? Uh, maybe a little Debbie, what? like a snack cake. Yeah. Okay. Okay. I'm fully awake. As you see, when I started this, I was waking up out of a slumber, couldn't sleep, and I decided to get back into this album and get, get some stuff done while I was on the road. Anyway, M is definitely... If you're following along at home, you're definitely seeing that M is trying to get canceled. <laughs> right? So he said, before I get banned and kicked off Twitter and TikTok. So he named pretty much all the social media platforms, I guess. You know, the ones that, well, he didn't name Instagram and Facebook. But anyway, the ones that people watch the most. Anyway, they want to bounce me like a sap fabric softener. Bounce, of course, is a fabric softener, right? Don't in the dryer. Before you get rid of me of me of Yay, kick rocks with with him. You just got rid of Yay. Well, that's what he said. <laughs> oh, so I'm saying that they're saying, look, we got we got Kanye counsel. We'll get you counsel. But he said, well, Dre on the beats with the blonde, white face blonde on the mic, of course, that's slate shady. And what steady being cool C, of course, steady being cool C. Remember them from back in the day if you were hip hop youngster, right? But also, they end up, it was a long thing. They end up, um, they end up shooting somebody, a police officer or something like that, a bank robbery, something like that back in the day. Oh, anyway, 
and we wrap and did a bank robbery on the side. So that's where that comes from. Um, they want beef. We can make it like a Bonnie and Clyde, Bonnie and Clyde, Bonnie and Clyde. So that's what that is. The whole dad thing. If you know the history of him and his dad and also his mom. But then at the end, he made a little funny. He says, mate, but mom, do I act eight or maybe a little Debbie weight, like a snack cake, a little Debbie, the oatmeal snack cake. If you're not from the South. You probably ain't never seen a little Debbie, but anyway. Let's go. But if this is what he do to his mom, I'm be like a snack cake. But if this is what he do to his mom, imagine what he do to you. I'm a lunatic arm, and if it's you, I used to clip on for you to respond. It's ludicrous, ma. Look at what you do to respond. I remember the you remember the the trailer for that with the the little baby looking like the devil coming out in the in the, in the operating room. Okay. It's all coming together there. You to respond is ludicrous. Ma, look at what you to respond. Must be a cold day in hell. Tell me what have we done? Take me out my misery. I bought heaven with it was up for sale. And now I need a refund, baby. Yeah. Wait, what the fuck? Where I put my... I think someone messed with my meds. Probably, I bet it's my ex, Molly, that I bled in the death. Already seventh the head. I smell the fresh and the flesh rotting, so it's breakfast in bed. If I wake up next to a dead body. Multiple lacerations, contusions, abrasions, bruises, hallucinations, delusions, abusive. My language uses, they lose it when Drake produced it. As soon as he plays the music, it's lunacy. Treat the beat like a choice. Shady, choose it. <laughs> this lunacy treat the beat like a choice. Shady, choose it. I bet it's my ex Molly. I bludgeon to death. Molly. Ecstasy, you know, he used that cleverly, right? I think someone messed with my meds, probably. I bet it's my ex, Molly. Molly X City, Ecstasy, plus in the death. That's clever, right? I love when he said, then they lose it when Dre produces as soon as he plays the music, it's lunacy. Keep the beat like a choice, Shady chooses it. Come on, man, clever. He plays the music, it's lunacy, treat the beat like a choice, shady, choose it Now all I see is dollar signs, losers Bitch, I was in them trenches like them Columbine shooters like them Columbine shooters. I was down bad, broken, almost abandoned hope Now my followers are like a satanic cult Yeah, they listen to me like when Manson spoke They say I don't know struggle no more, that's a joke Bitch, the fucking elevator in my mansion's broke I have to walk like half a block to get a can of coke And candy so I ain't mad at her I ain't gonna throw the fact bitch forgot she was black Back at her, laugh at her like them crackers She's back and after her back is turned in a cute maga hat With her brand new white lies mad at shirt nope. Or say this maga dirt bag and a skirt Just open the biggest can of worms on the whole planet Earth call a grand wizard clan That's a grand dragon or like the national anthem I won't stand for the tramp but I can't diss her Cause my plans are to get in her pants and I blow my chance if I answer back to her My shit is Candace Owens, boy, boy, boy. I heard she was upset and I heard she called him gay or something like that. Didn't know why. I love the part about saying his followers are like a satanic cult, but they listen to him like he don't know struggle no more, right? <laughs> what he says, his, his elevator is broken. He has to walk a block. Get a can of coke. The similarities make poking fun of those folks saying talking about his struggle, but he's in a mansion and his and his elevator's broke. He has to walk a half a block. Hence his house is big. He's in a mansion. And then Candace Owen, he said, I can't get mad at her. Cause at the end of it, he's saying, I can't diss her because my plans are getting her pants and I'll blow my chance at her to answer back. <laughs> Clandis Grand Wizard for her brand new White Lives Matter shirt. Remember her and Kanye wore those shirts. Remember that? Oh, 
my gosh, and all the other stuff in between. You, I, I don't have to reiterate because you know. Sometimes you can get on one. Anyway, I'm just going to listen and shut up. It's because my plans are to get in their pants and I blow my chance if I answer back to her. My shit is like taking Deborah Mathers at a word. Yeah, I'm not absurd. We had a spat and afterwards we squashed the beef like a hamburger patty. Or should I say gigantic turd? Because I put that shit to bed like Amber Heard at a mattress firm. But if this is. So I guess he's explaining this because. Thought they were done. We squashed the beef like a hamburger patty, or should I say a giant turd? Should I cause it put the crap to bed like Amber Heard at a mattress firm? Amber Heard. <laughs> oh, okay, yeah, 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 yeah. Amber Heard. Um admit she pooped in Johnny Depp's bed, right? Remember that in the case? I was trying to put that together. This what he do to his mom. Imagine what he do to you. I'm a lunatic arm. And if it's you, I used to clip on. For you to respond is ludicrous. Ma, look at what you to respond. This must Lucifer. be a cold day in hell. Ooh. Tell me what have we done? Take me out my misery. I bought heaven when it was up for sale. Whether you friend or you are foe, far as bars go, even fucking retards know that as far as smoke with me, I don't think it'd be smart. So, might as well go looking for smoke with Lamar, bro. But Lamar, so. He said, okay, I'm messing around a little bit, but don't get it twisted. If you want to go bar to bar, you want to go, you want to look for some beef, hey, I'm here. Go looking for smoke. You might as well go look for smoke with Kenneth Lamar, bro. Yeah, he respects Kendrick Lamar, bro. Don't get it twisted. Ain't no diss. I don't want to hear nothing about no diss. I've seen all stuff online about dissing. He is not dissing Kendrick Lamar, okay? But also, I've seen the video where him and Kendrick was going to do a, a do a song, and then he heard him spit, and like, wait a minute, this ain't. So he thought he had he had a bunch of people with it, so he thought he had Ghost Rider. So he sent Kendrick, his Ghost Rider, away and had him write something in the booth. And he like destroyed it, and I'm like, yeah, I respect this dude's pen. So, that's homage and respect, but also he know who won the beef. Smart, so might as well go looking for smoke with Lamar, bro. But Marshall, you're getting more perverse every time you record a verse, and it's like you came from 2000, stepped out of portal, cursing, hurling horrible slurs towards the world, and why can't you make fun of people behind their backs like a normal person? But when you reach these heights, freedom of speech dies. With every line that I recite, then PC police try to throw me in jail with no bail, like a peace prize for all of them years. What? They reduce me to tears. I like that. I like that. I love how we just say, you know what? Why can't you be like everybody else and sneak this or talk about them behind their back? But he says, when you reach those heights, read them a speech die. I get it. I get it. Jeff with no bell like a peace prize for all of them years. What? They reduced me to tears. Yeah. They tried to shrink me to peace size. Only to see my what? self esteem rise. Now these are my replies. Mm. They made me eat shit. shit. I fed it back to him three times. Yeah. The father's the only what? one I ever been beat by. Yeah. Squeeze mics like Burmese pie. Yeah. Dances for each time. What? You sleep on the floor. What? How you hear these strings climb? Yeah. You reap what you sow. So what? So first I must weep rhymes. Yeah. So seamlessly, then I'ma leave eyes in a state of disbelief. My genius is a trait. trait. So the gaps in our genes, right? The gap. <laughs> At least that's what it seems like. And I'm Lucifer and Dre's the producer for the Antichrist. Oh my gosh, and we're doing that song next real quick. I love that scheme. I love the last part of that, right? How he was just talking about counseling people, the PC police. And then it says the only time he's been beat is by his stepfather, right? Talked about squeeze might like Burmese pythons each time to sleep on the flow hear these streams climb when you reap what you sow so i must weave rhyme so seamlessly then i'm going to leave eyes in a state of disbelief genes is a trait so gaps in our genes right 
Good Lord, have mercy. Reap what you sow. It needs sowing and weaving seamlessly. Then I, I'm going to leave eyes. Levi's as in Levi's in disbelief, also Levi genes. Genes is a trait. It's a gap in our genes. A gap in our genes, like Jen's generation, but also a gap in our genes that we wear. Also, gap store. Come on, M. All right, man. There you have it. We did all you got on Lucifer. Now we're going to go to the song. Somebody told me this is the song that I'm going to definitely going to need to listen to. So I'm just going to shut up as we get canceled along with him. <laughs> it's FW subscribe to the light, but peace. Just like music.